Okay, okay. Hello, this is Tyler, and welcome back to another live stream. Even though. <laughs> it's probably a Halloween game, but I can do it at the moment. <laughs> I can do Ben the Envying Machine, but I, I, and I'm stuck with that. And then we got. Um, the Mortuary Assistant, but again, I'm. Start with that. But hello, this is Tyler, and welcome back to uh, At Dead of Night. <laughs> but yeah, so I've got two things. What? And there's one game what I don't want to go back to. We all know why I don't want to go back to it. Let's show you one of the shorts why I don't want to go back to. At the end of the night. Uh, Tyler. Uh, Tyler. Oh, I forgot how to spell my own the thing. So, yeah. But 2.0 at dead of night. There we go. So. Let's see if I can find the... Uh, no, I don't really have a good luck with this one. Where's the scary bit? Sometimes that? I don't know who are you. Who about you? <laughs> That's... Uh, I'll put that one up as well, but... It's yours. That... Dead... Of... Night... You can tell how I'm trying... Uh, night... You can tell how I'm just trying to. This is it. This is the bit, I think. No. He looks born down there, but. Remember one of them. No, that's just it. Is that just Sometimes that, that gets me. I can see him, I, uh, I bet you. Bloody hell. My god. My words got worse through this. But. Is this it? God, my mic. At least that was a very old mic. Oh, you go. Yeah, how old's that old subtle kid? Get out of my hotel. This is my hotel. Get out of my hotel, Henry. Yeah, so that's when we got. But which one was it? Because even one of the viewers was scared. one short and then we go and watch it. New Minecraft skin, you know it boys. And you're watching and you guys aren't normally here and you definitely aren't normally watching. So like <gasps> Coy. Hello. 
Hello. I thought I heard the door open, but I didn't know. No, it did. I didn't. It wow. Didn't open. Wow. I was. I wanted to give my review on the Capri Sun. Yeah, or I was going for it. Hmm. Okay, that's for one. That's it. Yeah, no, it's not on there anymore. But that game. Really did get me. And, and I do remember a few stuff of on the game, and I'm gonna. Well, I don't know why, I just don't turn it down on my monitor thing. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I, I can do that now. Once when. Oh, here we go again. That's Man Up and Finally Do It. Welcome to the. Welcome back to a dead of night. I do feel a bit more calmer now. I've got zero percent. Well, what am I? What what happened? What am I supposed to do? What, uh, what happened? Do we? Oh, well, yeah. I just realised I've not got the. Oh no, I do have the machine. Maybe do it have an answer. The boy. Do they have, have a squire with me? Forgot I, f I forgot about the squire. He comes up in the corner, don't it? The squiring mirror. I'm not shouting, Jimmy. No offense, you. Don't know what that is, but I've forgotten. <laughs> you don't press stuff you. <laughs> I think uh, in that one, and that's why I've seen the blood stained cloth. Oh fuck off! <laughs> I don't want you to woohoo. Not even with me. Just don't woohoo. I do. And how do I flip in squire? For the coin to this, I should be able to squire. Well, how's that going to be helping me? Or oh, do I have a squire mirror? I don't, I don't have a feeling now that I have a squire mirror. Oh, lovely. Look for this by holder because I don't fuss. That now I'm just opposite of my other door. Lovely. So that's fun. I see you. No, you don't. I have a feeling I just play this every scary week, every scary month. Once a year. <laughs> and I play it twice in that month. It's still flipping dark, isn't it? Oh my camera. There we go. I do have a feeling though. I might play Minecraft after. Because it's not Tyler without Minecraft. I'm just waiting for him. Cause he's not even said anything. But I know he's hiding. Cause I've jumped across this room and he says I see you. Hides behind the wall. And now he's waiting for me to come out. I don't know that's him. He's quiet now.
I do not right now. Now let's wait here for a bit. Wait for him to come back here and go back in. Oh. Again, it's a game what I won't really play anymore, this game. And I was near at the end and then the game decided to start from the beginning and I'm like, oh. Lovely. And it, really the thing was, is if it didn't if it didn't go back to the start I was gonna end it anyway. But no, if it went to the start, I was gonna end it because this is how I thought about it. But I think it's 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 basically gone. <laughs> this is this is basically gone from the channel. Because I do like scary games, but this one's up on a high level. If if the Jack Septi stop playing it, that's how you know it's gone bad. <laughs> okay, I think he was in. I don't know if was in four videos and three videos in, and then he just left it. But I tell him that much. He's got the good brains for it. So I'm like, oh, why don't you go back to it? Now I'm thinking, I don't want to go back to it. I'm only doing this for, for, okay, i tell you the truth. I'm only going to do this once and see how I feel with it. But how that short got me, I think it's time to say goodbye and put good old Jimmy back in his box and start something new on the Halloween, on the scary part of it. But yeah. I am still going to be doing things like because I like to do scary games what I like. Used to be liking this, and then it was worse when I got scared. I think and my glasses fell off my face. And that's how bad one of them got. And, I'm, and I think this is what it, it keeps coming back to. I got scared. My glasses fell off my face, and then. Where is the squire glass, sir? I need a squire. And where's Jimmy? Hey! That was close. That was close. I'm starting uploading a few VODs to the uh, Tanimitri 2.0 channel now. There he is, coming. He's coming by. Um, just to uh, show him that I am still here with that, uh, with that channel. Um, because there has been... I know I shouted you. And there has been things going through my mind, so that saying to myself, should I, should I leave YouTube and just start Twitch, or do I try to do them both? And I think the kids channel, trying to juggle with them too. I can do them a little bit, but it's hard work. It is getting hard work for to do two things at once. But I think the Tanner Mitchell 2.0 what was my very first channel. I think that one well, it was my very first channel, what well, we used to be a kids friendly channel. A few years later turned it into a adult channel and then this is where it came from. And that's the YouTube channel what I immediately decide to come from. If, because with my uh, channels, I've got a few channels what I just link with stuff. And I'm linked with the Telemetry 2.0 channel. My other channel, the children friendly one, that's linked with something on here on the Twitch platform, what's called... Uh, 
Talon Mitchell 2004. Now, the story with Talon Mitchell 2004 and 2003 is I'm supposed to be made like a robot and and I'm I'm the broken one. <laughs> I'm actually trying to see me broken on air. I'm feeling you can really see. <laughs> I'm a, I'm I'm the Talon Mitchell bot, but what's well, supposed to be kids friendly, but isn't. There's no more hiding, Maya. Oh, well, there is because I'm still I'm still hiding, you may. See, I start getting with it, and I start calming down. But I don't like games what I calm I calm down at f a few minutes after I pl um, open them. Minecraft easy. Everything else easy. I do want to get an other game from Minecraft though. So. Oh, f I do want to do an hour on it. I really do want to do an hour on this, but <laughs> if that door does that out of the school. Oh, shut up, Jimmy. If that one don't have a squire glass, then we'll go... I knew you know you knew I was in it. And of course, of course that made me jump. <laughs> God. Yeah, fuck off, Jimmy. I knew you was waiting for me. It's up there for thinking and down there for dancing, Jimmy. If that one don't have a squire glass or nothing in, well, I really need a squire glass because that's the important bit. Right, just, just to look at my thing. Oh, what do I have? Oh, I have a dead lot for this door anyway. Okay, that's good. Okay, didn't want to really go out, but I'm out. Well, there's nothing in there. Well, that's good. Do I have three? No, I don't. Okay. Right, well, it looks like I made it in this one early. I can never go back to this at all. <laughs> I'm People might say I'm overreacting. I'm just not. I've played it that many times now. Jimmy and did. Yes, let me out. Well that one I am out. But let's go back that Just call it Minecraft. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing on Minecraft, but I'm doing I'm doing Minecraft. I can't never play at the at Dead of Night again. Probably in a few years. I don't really want to know. <laughs> So Minecraft. So continue. I'm Lucky Acorn. I don't want to be Lucky Acorn, but I'm happy to be Lucky Acorn. But it's still the wrong channel. Let me just go over to my face because I will have to change my account. But yeah, Minecraft is coming on at the moment. Let's put uh, some YouTube on in the process. Move that there. Press that, put some. So, if you can hear any noises outside, I don't know why, but people are shouting. Happened on every channel. First, this thing on this channel is only the flipping stone for that moment. I think it was a stone. Right, it has to be a stone. Let's put. 
Do we have any new, new news now? Uh, let's go on here. Yeah. When this guy tried picking up his McDonald's order, he came across a problem he definitely wasn't expecting. Oh. The order's right there. Homeboy standing right there with his AirPods in. Yo, my man. But what's even worse is that this video went so viral that the official McDonald's Instagram commented on his video. Who would you oh. be this patient? When this guy tried picking up his Not McDonald's really. order, oh, he came across a thing. problem he definitely wasn't expecting. My order's right there. Hmm. Monkey see, monkey do. <laughs> This is what happens when a world champion pool player shows up to a casual game, hitting one of the most exquisite shots ever. This is what happens when a world champion pool player shows up to a casual game, hitting one of the most ex- Dad, I want okay. you to meet my new girlfriend. You have a girlfriend? Hi, I'm Natalie. Hi, Natalie. Nice to meet you. Can I come over sometime? Yeah, of course. Anytime. Cool. See you then. See Bye. You. Do you like her? I do. She seems like a sweet girl. <laughs> Dad, I want you to meet my new girlfriend. You have a girlfriend? Your son's girlfriend is a ninja. Hi, I'm Natalie. Hi, Natalie. <laughs> How did you live on $50 a day? So I found this out. If you ate the whole pizza, you'd get the pizza for free, and they'd put your name on the wall. So I go over and crush my pizza. I'm like, wow, that's crazy. Went back the next night, did it again. The guy's like, wow, that's crazy. Went back the next night, did it again. The guy was running out of pizza trays. He's like, dude, if you want a free slice, just... Yeah. <laughs> How did you live on $50 <laughs> a day? So I found this out. If you... <laughs> oh, fuck. I read your mind. I saw what you were planning, and then I trumped your hand by going all in. How did you... You can read minds. I can think at super speed. Your thoughts, after I read them, you reshuffled the deck. I guess <laughs> the house doesn't always win. <laughs> you changed the Wi-Fi password? Yeah, I did. What was it again? Ready? C-L-E-A-N-U-R-E-F-F-I-N-G-R-O-O-M. Got it? Wait, Dad, you know that's No. Dead. It didn't work. Oh, too bad. <laughs> hey, Dad, did you change the Wi-Fi? You guys won't believe this. <laughs> Just yesterday, I filmed a video of me jumping oh. to this pier. And I had no idea until one of my subscribers oh, commented oh, that there was a shark oh, in the yeah. top left corner of the screen. Yeah. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I am definitely not trying this challenge ever again. I don't blame you. Understand this? You're getting played. Maybe game for game. Please. Yeah, it'll be one for three dollars and three for ten dollars. Oh, okay. I'll take one. That'd be three dollars. I'll actually take another one. That'll be another three dollars. You know what? I'll take one last one. Great. Thank you. Do you realize that I just bought three for nine dollars instead of three for ten? Maybe business isn't your thing, man. People are funny. Each time they buy three watermelons instead of one, yet they keep trying to teach me how to do business. You don't understand. This? <laughs> You're getting played. Can I buy a watermelon? Stop. Sorry. Thank you. I'm not going to get you to do that again. Stop! There we go. Right. <laughs> thank you. Stop. Sorry, thank you. This man has gone viral because he has an incredible talent. His talent is that while descending an escalator, he has the ability to stop it completely. And it's not just on this escalator, he can do it on any escalator, anywhere he goes. But the craziest thing is that if you look at the people around him, they have no idea what's happening. Do you know how he did it? This man has gone viral not because really. he has an incredible talent. Editing? Can you oh watch God. that again? <laughs> This man tried to play a prank on his friend by doing a jujitsu move which would temporarily paralyze his body. And his plan was unsuccessful at first after he missed the pressure point. But moments later, his friend came back to get revenge and he executed it perfectly. 
<laughs> this man tried to play a prank on his friend. This is what happens when you watch too many Flash movies at once. This guy is the fastest arm wrestler in the world, and his moves are so fast that if you blink, that and ever. Some people say that his videos are fake, but watch how his opponents react after getting absolutely destroyed in less than a second. The first play and see if it works. This is what happens when you watch too many Flash movies at once. This guy is the fastest arm minute. wrestler in the world. Don't. I thought it was uh, going to give me a load, but now it's like, oh, you want you want to play Minecraft? Oh, just jump straight in. Now, you are almost out of data. Minecraft has resisted a, to this. Oh. So, in other words, you see my. I've got um, it's. I forgot. I'd stump. Um, I've got that skin. Oh God! I keep. I keep that skin on for now. Well, how is that gonna flip in help? I've got flipping Minecraft. One Minecraft world. You want me to start deleting? What do you want me to do, Minecraft? Make a deleting stream. Flipping. I don't want to. I want. Oh, oh. <laughs> that still shocks me to this day. Well, it's still gonna shock me that I've still got flipping stampy. I know. Well, classic skins. It's in now. If you wanna know where all the old skins are? It's in this classic skin. Apart from squids, I think it's in a party squ uh, party skin for uh, a party pack for squid. The old ballistic squid uh, skin. Stampy's just for classic. Because everyone likes the, this one anyway. I don't know it was still here. Okay, it wants me to delete stuff. But I don't want to delete anything. Well, let's put back Minecraft. Uh, back. Let's put that back on. And see if I've got... Oh, stop it. Escape. Yes. That's the switch account to. Oh, there, I'll show my emails again. <laughs> I'm not allowed to share that, but I will show shorts. In this scene, Robert Downey Jr. offers real blueberries to Mark Ruffalo and Chris Evans. Hi, blueberry. However, this part wasn't in the script. In fact, the blueberries weren't supposed to be there at all. The actor spent long hours on set, so Robert Downey Jr. hid snacks around the set to eat when he got hungry, and no one noticed. In this scene, Robert okay. Downey Jr. when they were on their motor Should've given that scene, light there, light Robert that Downey one. Jr. when they were on their motorcycles and she saw her boyfriend wave at a girl, he instantly looked back, knowing that looked bad. So his girlfriend then took off to catch up to see the girl that he waved to, shocked that he did that in front of her. And when she looked inside, she noticed it was just a little girl that was watching her. Now realizing her boyfriend was just being a good guy. When they were on their motorcycles and she saw her boyfriend wave at a girl, he instantly... <laughs> Scene 37 of switching to Trevor till he does something normal. Mm. What is he doing there? Flipping being sick in a pool. Uh, I swallowed that nose ring in the 90s. <laughs> See 37 of switching... <laughs> he followed the nose in the 90s and came back up. Oh, God. Uh, let's delete them. Sorry. Uh, that one. Uh, not working, okay, that's good. Oh, shit. And how... Ah, <laughs> oh, let's press delete on that one then. I've got a few things on here, what I have... Got, but I am trying to delete, um... 
I don't, I don't know where I want to put that one in there. Uh, mm, this is where I put all my VODs. You might say they're not very organised. You're right, there isn't. I've not organised half of them um, until now. Until this year. And again, I started sometime last year <laughs> on my PC. And I find in things for Minecraft. Look, I've got even this one. It's called Min Minecraft Bedrock 1 and Minecraft Bedrock because I don't know the numbers for these. And Twitch just took them off, so. But. He's going to finish off the rails. So, is it. Because, again, that could have been the one after I came back and didn't want to play Minecraft for a bit. And, and when I went to go back to it, I couldn't. And then I went back to it, and then I've got things that I want to play, but it, things that I want to do, but I can't, can't play particularly on it. But there's things. Even got the kids' channel on it. And I've got oh, put these up recently. Again. So, um, sorry there's not been a video for. Sorry there wasn't been a video for a long time. That's me. This coming back after a break. But. And then I've got normal bedrock. What? I don't know for this. But again, it must have been after I came back. Yeah, that's me talking about the song, so that must have been one when I come back. I oh, don't know. Again, because even got this one yesterday's on here. Again, does it have. And I don't know why, but my mic's never connected where I come on. I might as well just use my flipping this mic. Gotta turn this off because you're probably gonna be hearing me. <laughs> so there we go. That's probably what's happened. <laughs> if you're hearing twice of me, it's both of them. Um, but and these are the uh, videos. What my um, my things. And I think that's when I must have said the c word anyway. So I'm happy that that I can make it a bit more cleaner for YouTube. Uh, but again, at dead of night, seventy percent. That's how far I went. You can tell I'm not gonna get seventy. I'm not gonna try to get seventy percent this time. I've because at least I had something to say. Oh yeah, you can do it. But now it's like I've got zero percent on every fucking thing. How am I gonna fucking do it? <laughs> so I just left it. Uh, Minecraft we're doing, aren't we? Let's see if we got room now, because after I deleted a few stuff. Again, went to play Minecraft, all went bad. Coming back, and now, hmm, we're having some issues. Please try to connect. Try to connect. I know what I'm going to try to connect. Uh, don't know why, but again, I do want to get that for the kids' channel because I have a few ideas, and I can have a few ideas for this one blowing up the tree for childhood. <laughs> no, no, I won't do that to stamps anyway, not not to the cat. Um, what was that? Uh, let's do a bit of. Horror. But again, I'm doing the exact same thing what I did before. No, not Bigfoot. No, we're not going back. It's my only yarn that's there as well. Oh. Oh, 
Now let's just search it up again. I don't want to play Bigfoot. I've played it once before and it's crap. It's fucking shit. I don't want to play the Holland map again. Uh, where is it? Do you have like textures? No, world. Uh, adventure map. Yeah, adventure map. I won't mind adventure map. I love an adventure map. And I do think I do need a just. Oh, don't really want to play Slender. Hmm. Ooh. I have to play the dropper. I know what I'm like though. Let's buy it. I'll go to my face because I'm because I know what I'm like. I'm like, oh, it's be fine. I remember doing that on flipping Twitch, and I know my money is fine, but <laughs> I shouldn't be buying stuff. <laughs> I've been saving this month <laughs> for one or a few weeks in uh, Brighton next year. Uh, Minecraft store item two is it item two? I've got item two. It's called item two. <laughs> Why would it be called item two? I don't want to change. That's the, that thing. That's it. Pay with that. Pay with it. It's that. Pay with it. You bastard. Pay. I've been having lots of problems with my card anyway. Um, looks like you already own it. You already own it, but you can buy it again if you want. I go and press it. It did that. Yeah, now it's in. Looks like you only own this. Wait. Please check your internet connection. Yeah, I always blame the connection, don't worry. Even though I only own it. See? I think Billy already seen the item too anyway. And now it's like It's done. <laughs> well, give that one a bit. That's good, Stumpy. Might as well get the things what I want because I know what I'm like. <laughs> 4J Studios. Four pound ninety nine, and it's item six. <laughs> it's item bloody six. Item one, item six. Went to one to six. If Stampy's lovely world works, I'm gonna be gobsmacked. So, you want me to play Stumpy the Lovely World and not the other app, my other game, what I wanted to play? Fuck! God. <laughs> Love you, Stumpy, I do, but. It comes to things where you can only buy flipping that fun. Uh, where was I? Uh, filter it to uh, 
time to build a uh, adventure map. We all know, um, with me doing adventure maps, if there's no swears in it, I'll add it. So there we go. Even though I've already owned it, but if I already own it, what's the, dif what's the difference? I've got things there. So let's play the hover. Yeah. Drop off horror. I'm just I'm just calling it Minecraft horror dropper. Really, it's not for it. Just says uh, a horror dropper. Adventure, okay. It's not really adventure map then, but. God, I'm really not gonna change this skin, am I? It's me being me though. I won't change anything. Dropper of horrors. We have many delights in store for you, including our revolutionary 3D technology. Watching films is a thing of the past. Falling through them at a deathly breakneck speed, however, that is the future. Pick a film. All three acts are in the same hallway. Pick your act, then make your drop. Be careful, though. It's a long way down. <laughs> Oh dear. What's this? Welcome book. And welcome book. Okay, I'll read your welcome book. And 3D glasses. Oh. <coughs> welcome to the Dropper of Horrors Theatre. God, I, go, I, I always go British when I say theatre. Don't I? <laughs> To enjoy our features in the best way possible, please read the guide. Don't start my guide. A dropper is a... Yeah, I think, I think we know what a dropper is. We've all played droppers before, but if you don't know, you... Um, it's... Is it? Hi. Do you Hello. Want to play hide and seek? No. If you win, I'll give you a prize. No, thank I you. I play in the theater sometimes. They're awfully cozy. Am I here? Am I there? Come see. Come find me, and we can play forever and ever. <laughs> That's a reference. Do you know how I get that reference? <laughs> uh, narrator. Yeah, go on. Let's get the narrator to a seat. The Howling Forest. When little Timmy and Ben asked their parents if they could go camping, they said no. There's wolves out there. It's too dangerous, his mother said. We'll take a trip somewhere else next summer. But little Timmy and Ben didn't listen, and they didn't want to wait. That night, they climbed down the dark steps to the cellar and packed their camping kit. Sleeping bags, lights, snacks, and most importantly, marshmallows. They snuck out into the forest, going deeper and deeper into the woods until they found their spot. In between trees, shielded from the wind, a level ground, and no parents. Timmy and Ben quickly built a fire and got out their roasting sticks. The marshmallows softly sizzled over the embers of their fire, and their laughter rang out through the trees. Their parents would never find out, they giggled. Oh, but they did. Only two days later, 
when they found a ruined campsite. Ah, could you be as a narrator? Because again, uh, you, you you can add your own tint to it. Because uh, hey, heard the dropper. Hopefully it's easy. Nope. Ah, shit. Worse, and uh, let's not. Let's redeem. Redeem this. Ah, fell on the tree again. <laughs> oh, I really do love droppers. This don't come back and play for a long while because this happens. <laughs> And that happens. There we go, I've done it. So I get anything else down here or is it just a bit again, that's what a drop is all about, you drop or die. You drop or die. The Howling Forest Act two has been now opened. But then Act two Oh, I'm going that's act one, so it's act two. Where's act two? Where's act two? Where is it? The Hounding Forest, act two. Don't know why I keep going up this. <laughs> yeah, there we go. That's act one, so now we've got two. Um, Timmy and Ben had gorged themselves on candy and chocolate. Their tummies were bloated, and all they could do was lie on their backs. I think I ate too many marshmallows, Ben said. Me too, Timmy said. Ben clutched his belly. I think I need to take a tinkle, and he wandered off into the woods. The first ten minutes Ben was gone, Timmy wasn't worried. But after thirty minutes passed, Timmy was trembling in his shoes. Where was Ben? Why hadn't he come back? Ben? He called out, but there was no answer. The wind whistled between the gaps of the trees, and everything seemed sinister. But little Timmy was brave. Maybe Ben had just fallen asleep. <laughs> Timmy stood up, took his light, and tried to track Ben's footsteps from the camp. First, they led to a tree, but then there were more tracks, and they weren't just footprints. A large, wide press, like a sledge, had been dragged across the forest floor. Ben must have found something big and dragged it somewhere. He was probably trying to hide it from Timmy. He always did annoying things like that. He never wanted to share. Timmy followed the tracks until they led to an old spelunking cave. The iron grates in front of the cave had rusted and bent. Loose cobwebs hung on the bars fluttering gently as cold air flowed out of the cave. Timmy hated spiders, but this is where Ben went, so that is where he must go. Besides, little Timmy had a light, and little Timmy was brave. So, a, so a splunking cave, okay? Uh, I've got a few uh, things that made me laugh in there, but... Yeah, and Tinkle could have said, well, you can't really say piss, is it? You need bears to come. And bounce. Do what I used to do on the adventure maps. Not adventure maps, but. You... Ah, shit. <laughs> so, trying to leave the thing again. So we bounce, and then. Bounce, 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 bounce. Miss the bouncing thing. I like to bounce. I should have got my stampy style boots up. I can't believe I'm still flipping playing the wall of stamps. <laughs> it's been it's been years since I've literally played the wall of any character again. When I used to be wearing this because I used to uh, download it anyway for free. And um, oh, oh, so that's uh, another one that's going to be done. And people thought I was actual stampy, but. Again, just say no, it's me. <laughs> I 
I'm the fake Stampy, I've always. <laughs> but again, I do like how he is. Uh, so, that one. Inside the cave, spiders scuttled away from Timmy's light, crawling into small cracks. The larger ones stayed their ground, eyeing little Timmy as if to dare him to break their web. But he didn't. Timmy crept and squeezed past any gap that he could. Ben was down there somewhere. Hmm. A bat squeaked and flew out of the cave as Timmy approached, and he yelled out in surprise. After he realized, Timmy laughed at his foolishness. It was just a bat, not scary at all. Just then, he heard soft footsteps approaching him from the other side of the cave. Ben? He called out, but no answer. Mm -hmm. Ben, if that's you, stop it. It's not funny. The footsteps stopped. Ben? Little Timmy raised the light above his head, peering into the darkness, but he couldn't see anything. He walked further into the cave, every muscle tensing in his body, willing him to turn back. But little Timmy was brave. He wouldn't run from footsteps. Just then, Timmy saw a dark figure move in the shadows. Ben? He called out. But it wasn't Ben. The dark figure leapt at Timmy, and the last thing he saw was the dark yellow eyes and sharp white teeth of a shaggy grey wolf. And that's the end of Timmy. <laughs> Who needs, who needs fucking that dead of a night when you got this? Ah! I'm gonna tell the guy into his mouth. I, I brought my life on his teeth. Ah! Keep breaking my legs on his teeth. At least I know I'm not that bad. I'm. <laughs> no, I have to know I'm not that bad to fall on a bat. But I've just fell on a bat. Now I know I'm very bad. Pfft, I'm to get into the flipping cave. Ah, pfft, I'm taking the flipping bat now. Come on, come on, Tyler. Ah, Again, at least on my first two tries, I've nearly got into the hole. There, I get myself a bit more comfortable. Ee, -ee I don't want ee. -ee. I don't want ee, ee ee. Ah, brother, you see her teeth again. But I'm at least I'm getting further and farther off those teeth. Not off that for the. Ah, I'm, I'm, I'm in his mouth. Little Tim, I'm little Timmy and, I'm, and I am in his mouth. I don't mean little Timmy's mouth. Oh, that sounds weird. Uh, there we go. Oh, this is his stomach. Now, yeah. this is four, okay. Two days of rain followed little Timmy and Ben's camping trip, clearing away their tracks. But their parents still searched for them. A whole search party scoured the forest, but it was only on the second day that they found Timmy and Ben's campsite. The tents were torn and shredded. The food they hadn't eaten scattered across the floor. Soggy marshmallows and sandwiches left by a fire that had long since fizzled out. They never found Timmy or Ben. The only thing left was Ben's coat, caught on the prickly branches of a pine tree. And there was never to be seen of again. The end of the big, big man to me and, and big man Ben. And that is complete. Hopefully the, them are not just going to be that easy if they are. Start flipping manning up Minecraft make creators and start flipping making them again. Uh, 
I know they they hate it, but again, if they wanted to keep playing Minecraft, you they have to love it. And let's go to this one. Oh, what is this then? Night of Missing Pet. Act one. There we go. <laughs> Let's put that one in here and then just pull. We got three, two, and one. There we go. New box, so I'm not gonna looking. Oh, yeah, we're gonna press that thing. Night of the Missing Pet. Okay. Zombie loved his cat. He called her Emmy, and they went on all sorts of trips together. They went running by the river, climbing over rocks, and lazing under trees. But the most fun was when they terrorized the local villagers of Wheatburn. Emmy would lure the villagers around corners with her soft meow, where Zombie would be waiting to scare them. But now, those times were over. After their scare trips, Zombie would be tired, but Emmy was always still full of energy, so she would venture out into the wild on her own. Sometimes she wouldn't be back for days, but this time, it was much longer. After a week, Zombie went out searching, and he found her by the riverside, bruised and broken. The villagers had taken their revenge on his cat, Emmy. Zombie was stricken with grief and hate. His friend, the mad scientist, tried to comfort him, but Zombie couldn't shake it. The villagers need to pay, but they would wait. First, Emmy needed to be buried. Zombie took her body to the local graveyard, where he began to dig hard and fast. He didn't look up until he was surrounded by the dirt walls of the grave. When it was deep enough, he climbed out to get Emmy, but she was missing. He looked everywhere, but he couldn't find her. The only person who knew he was burying her tonight was himself and his friend, the mad scientist. Zombie looked up at his friend's castle, the lights were on in the windows. The strange contraptions working their green smoke. Maybe the mad scientist wasn't his friend after all. Well, it probably was. He's sciencing up a probably a flipping chore or something. But again, that's how it always goes. Oh, hello. What are you doing? Uh, I didn't really want that to happen, but okay. I wanted to bounce before I go down a hole. I need bounce! Oh, well, well, I would bounce if I should have blow up that well. There we go. Drag to the top I go. Act 2 now, in it. Down there. Then that one and then that one. This is fun. <laughs> I love it. And missing pet, let's see, he's going to be going to the scientist, the lab, oh god, that's going to be a hard thing to go for. Zombie quickly ran up to the castle and burst through the door. Mad scientist, he yelled, where is my cat? He raced through hallways of armoured knights, shiny swords and crest shields but he couldn't find the mad scientist's laboratory. Zombie would get lost in this castle before he found Emmy, but it didn't matter. He had to do it. He had to avenge her. He burst through door after door, pushing over armor stands and decorations through the castle. Destruction and rubble followed in Zombie's wake. He would level this castle to the ground if it meant finding Emmy, but he didn't have to. He turned a corner and saw the telltale green hue of his old friend's experiments. A tall iron door with metal grates stood in his way. I'm coming, Emmy, 
Zombie said, and he pushed the door open. Okay. And then he realised he's just helping you. <laughs> Don't say it's all the way out there. Well. Where's the hole? Oh, it's because in front of it, I don't know, the hole. Oh, the house! Oh, the, in there, there we go. First time as well. Um, anything? Yeah, uh, that's gonna be... Now, let's have a check. Is it what I thought? Oh, I'm going the wrong way again. <laughs> Popcorn? Popcorn? Are you the missing cat? The mad scientist's laboratory was just as difficult to navigate as the castle. Bottles and jars of strange green liquids sat on shelves and desks. Otherworldly tendrils poked out of walls and mechanical spiders with human heads skittered across the floor. Zombie would destroy all of it if any was harmed. Every last bottle and tube, every table and chair, Zombie would even tear down the stone walls, and the mad scientist himself? He would rip him apart like paper, shred him to pieces. First those villagers killed his cat, and now his only friend stole her from him? No, Zombie would not stand for this. He ran through the laboratory, knocking things over as he went, the mechanical whirs of the mad scientist's machines droning in the distance. No doubt he was already performing experiments on Emmy. Experiments that he was going to stop. The droning became louder. Zombie was getting closer. He heard a laughter coming from behind a door frame. He rushed to the door and what he saw made his jaw drop. In the center of the room was Emmy hooked up to a machine. Alive and purring. A greenish tint to her fur. Oh dear, just bringing them back to life. No. Oh no, glass. Glass has always been my weakness in this anyway. And droppers. Like that. <laughs> Let's do it again. Oop, time work. Ooh. Well. Uh. Oh. I'm going to fall down a gap. Not that gap though. Anything but that gap. Gotten worse, though. Well, it's because I've really didn't pay any attention that round. Oh, my weakness again. Mm. Ah! Forgot about the puckles. God, I've gotten worse and worse and worse. There we go, I'm back. Oh, no! No! I want to know what it's. I, I want to know what happens at the end. Please let me know what happens at the end. In that fucking pole! Oh. Yeah! Yeah! 
don't know why I'm always trying to make a meow. What? What am I doing? Why am I even doing that? Why do I? No. Let's just do it. Oh, I'll do it. Do it. That's how I would usually do it. Uh, come on, I can do it. Well, you, when you're being Q, it's literally the same colour of being Q. <laughs> the orange. No. Uh. God, I'm dying on the first one again. I am shit at this though, part, uh, droppers. Apart from uh, the high pixel one, but again, where am I going back to high pixel? God knows. Let me see I know. <laughs> okay, uh, probably a few more times. Yeah, a few more times. <laughs> Green class. It's because there's no holes. Ah. Ah. Uh, a couple more times. God, that sound is driving me up the fucking wall, though. I've got to move myself forward, I'm doing it as well, so it's like, uh... Oh, shit! Shite! Fuck! <laughs> Other words what I can't say. <laughs> <laughs> I need to just go backwards, so it's like... This... Or not that. No, oh, not that. <laughs> I'll get down there soon. I will get there. I will get down there soon. I will. We will get down there. I tell you that much. We are gonna get down there. Don't rage quit. Do not rage quit. Do not rage quit. I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna get you the only dreamer that won't race quit out of a fucking game like Minecraft. What? I was barely near it and my fucking body's on. Uh, oh. I know people say, oh, it looks easy. Yeah. It might look easy for pros or stuff like that, but again, this is coming from a streamer who has not done anything on Droppers for. Last time I did it on Dropper, it was the arcade Dropper, and then that is that's another one not coming in fucking complete either. Check down this way. No, okay. Mm. 
Okay, sort of. I want to cheat, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to cheat. I do not cheat. No, I mean, if I did cheat, I'd flipping tell people anyway. I'm very bad at lying. Well, when it comes to streaming, I am. Ah. But when it comes into real life, I'm just like the Lion King at times. I'm surprised as well. Because people say autistic people are not really good at lying. And they just have brains for it. <laughs> and do I have the brains for even myself? Flap my legs a lot? Nope. I've got enough brains for that. I am going to end this stream here. <laughs> it's not because I'm <laughs> ready to quit in. I'm not ready to quit in. I'm um, just having a little break. From uh, Minecraft uh, for the rest of the day, <laughs> but guys, um, tomorrow. Give me one minute though. That's where that's going to stay in the bin. <laughs> so uh, we've got uh, Bendy and the Ink Machine, and we've got. Uh, no, we're not really thing we like to do, do we? Um, we got. We might do Bendy, or we could do not for broadcast. But again, I never know. So, a time when I think is it's gonna be a time when I don't really know what I'm gonna do. So, guys, I will see you all in the next one because I'm sounding like a narrator from the Stanley Parable. What would be coming back in 10 years, 9 years now, <laughs> still counting. <laughs> but guys, I'll see you all in the next one. Bye guys.